Hi, this is Wax Princess 31 and I am coming to you today with a review on Candles by Victoria. Today it's going to be on the Tureens um, that I purchased through um, from her. And I do have my daughter sitting next to me since I don't have um, the scent browser up. She is going to just tell me what scents she picks out. These are scents that I have tried, purchased in tarts or scoops and scents or crumbs that I absolutely have fallen in love um, with and I wanted to um, make them into a terrine. Now some of these are part of the line um, that you can pick from. Some of them are just scents that I put together. Um, that aren't part of the permanent line. I mean, you can choose those scents, but um, they're just not, um, there's no special name to it other than what I pick out. Um, and I'm going to start off with this beautiful one. This is the pomegranate. And this happens to be strawberry margarita. I'm not sure if my camera's going to pick up. And birds of paradise. And this is just fruity. I don't get any floral. It's in the drink category. Birds of Paradise has vanilla notes to it, strawberry notes. It's just a strawberry fruity drink. It reminds me of being on the beach, just an umbrella. This is my um my island getaway drink um, when I just think about being on the beach and what kind of fruity umbrella drink that I would like this is what I would like to order along with a hot cabana boy bringing it to me well not boy man anyway um, <laughs> this is again strawberry margarita with birds um, in paradise and it is um, fruity juicy it's got a lot of strawberry to it, so if you're not a strawberry fan, if you're not um, a vanilla fan, it's got a hint of vanilla. I don't get a whole lot of vanilla. The vanilla is what makes it creamy, but I get just a lot of strawberry, and this is just my personal opinion. It's got some other notes to it, but again, I don't have my browser up. I will, one of these uh, videos, have my browser up and give you guys a full rundown, but I'm going to let my daughter um, take a smell out of it and tell me what she gets out of it. Hmm. Strawberries, vanilla, smells very good. This is one of my favorites. Again, this is the pomegranate, and it's the terrines that you can order by Candles by Victoria. All right, and this one, I did not give it a name because I was so eager to get it. I just threw those two scents together and didn't think about naming it. You can name your scent. Um, I mean, your terrain, and I just didn't do it. Um, the next one up is going to be Hypnotic, and this is my choice of name in the um, pink glitter Halo. I'm sorry about that. And Hypnotic is spellbound which is one of my favorites and um pink sugar and it's amazing i kind of goofed and i did not i wanted to go with pink cupcake to make it a little bit more fruity foodie again since i'm a foodie fruity kind of girl um but i did not um I did not put the pink cupcake down. I put the pink sugar down. And I'm glad I did the pink sugar because the pink sugar, oh my goodness, it just makes it oh, so good, so juicy. Oh, it's amazing. Um, it kind of adds a little bit of perfume note to it. Um, and just, it not really bakery at all. I mean, what's well, bakery because it's spellbound. But it just, it, it has so many different notes in it. And it just smells so yummy. I cannot wait to burn this in the fall. I am saving this for um, later to burn. Um, not right now, just because of summer weather. Um, but I want it to give it a good time to cure. And again, this, look at that beauty. Look at all the pink and the glitter. Let's see. This is absolutely beautiful. I love it. Spellbound and pink sugar again. And you do get the double wit with those ones. I'm not sure if I already said that. And the next one up, this is the Halo Black. And 
I have a lot of light coming in here, so I'm not sure if it's going to pick up all the glitters. Absolutely beautiful. And this one is Magic Love Potion. And this has... Um, this has um, Love Potion um, number, number 9 in it, and it also has um, the Birds of Paradise to give it um, some strawberry notes to it, just kind of bring those strawberry. I wanted to enhance the strawberry notes in it. Love Potion number 9 was added to the permanent line of Candles by Victoria. It was just in her massage candle. And I am so glad that she brought this um, so you can order this scent and whatever you like. Whether you want scoops and scents, whether you want them in crumbs, whether you want them in scent shop form. It doesn't matter. You can order in whatever she has available. And this is amazing. Again, this glitter is not going to pick up that well. But this is a love potion. Magic love potion. Amazing. And the next one... This is the last one that I have down here. My love, um, I think it's the Lovebirds. That is, um, I don't, I burnt that one, um, and that one happens to be in a different location um, from where I'm at, so I can't review that one. Um, I will put that in a review. Um, this one is the Island Getaway, and this is in the aqua color. And look at that. And I'm not sure why I didn't go with the color for the pink sangria. Because this is pink sangria and gone grape. And when at first when I got this, I thought, oh my gosh, the gone grape is going to smell like medicine. I don't want it to smell like medicine. Like I'm taking cough syrup. Because sometimes with grapes, you get that scent. And I wanted a true grape. I didn't want a wine grape because um, it already has the grape note in it and I just wanted to enhance it a little bit so um, I decided to go with the Gone Grape and at first it kind of smelled a little like syrupy not medicine but kind of had that iffy smell so I wasn't sure if I was going to love it but oh my goodness I absolutely love this pink sangria and Gone Grape it just enhances the grape notes in it and it is just oh so juicy I mean, just, oh, it just makes your mouth water. I mean, amazing. I mean, it smells so good. Um, I love it. Love it, love it, love it. Other than not looking like a pink um, sangria, it's in the blue. Hey, it's what I wanted to order. So, there you go. Look at that. I absolutely love it. Well, last, last but not least, I am going to review this one since I only have one of these. And this is a doozy. Let me tell you. This is so nice. This has been curing for about um, two months now. And I absolutely love this. This is in one of my favorites, Watermelon Cupcake. Ooh, Timber. There goes one of the chunks. There goes another one, but these are absolutely amazing. And these, you can stick them right back in there and burn them. These are the little chunks of wax. Um, and she has this poured. This is you can get this in glitter. This is non-glitter. You see that white, the white milky um, wax, and then you get the wax chunks. And this again is in watermelon cupcake. And I'm not gonna tip it because I just don't want to lose any more of the top. But one of my favorite scents, again, this is Tiffany D and Pink Cupcake, and oh my goodness, you can't, couldn't get more of a better combination. It's absolutely amazing. Whoops. I'm going to put those bad boys in my warmer, the ones that are loose. But I absolutely love everything about this. I mean, look at that with the chunks. I mean, you put this on a table. I mean, this is a heavy-duty candle. you got hours of burning with this. I mean... The scent, you got your double wicks, your triple, I mean, there's three wicks. There's, um, I mean, so it's going to burn amazing. I mean, the scent throw, I can smell this thing across the room. This has been sitting on my dresser. Again, these are my terrines, and this is my Candleman's Cube. You can find these products at Candles by Victoria. I am running out of time, so thank you.